What it do, YouTube? It's Theo Ross. Um, got a, another little type of video for y'all today. I'm gonna be doing a commentary uh, about some UFC shit that's been going on like the past week. Um, but I got two things I want to talk about. I want to talk about uh, Chael Sonny. That motherfucker, he got some uh, battery charges against him. So does Jorge Masvidal on some on some crazy shit. Um, but yeah, let's get right into it. So probably the first thing I'm gonna talk about, um, Jorge Masvidal. You know, his ad just lost to uh, Kobe Covington, UFC 272. Um, unanimous decision, you know what I'm saying? So all three judges scoring for Kobe. Well, apparently they was outside a, a, a restaurant in Miami called Poppy Steak. I don't know, I'm probably saying that wrong, but that that's what I read. Anyways, they was outside a restaurant and they was still tweeting back and forth. I thought the shit personally was just an act just for they fight, but I don't know. I guess the motherfuckers really don't like each other. But yeah, they was outside a restaurant, and uh, one thing led to another. There's three people involved. There's Kobe, Jorge, and one unnamed person. I don't know. They didn't want to release their name. You know what I'm saying? But um, basically, they three was all out there and shit, and, you know, Kobe and Jorge, they was tweeting at each other, you know, going back and forth and shit. And basically, the unnamed person apparently said some shit about Jorge's kids. I don't know, there's like reports, witnesses saying uh, uh, Jorge was, you know, after the fact, talking to the motherfucker, like, don't, you know, don't say that about my kids and shit like that. So yeah, so Jorge uh, turns around and apparently he sticks the, the unnamed dude twice. And whenever he does, he like knocks out some teeth and shit. Uh, second shot, he hit his eye and everything. But um, yeah, so Kobe, runs away, runs the police, and this is this is all in the reports. You know what I'm saying? I'm I'm not I'm not making up no story or nothing like that. Um he runs to the police and tells him, "Oh, he's over there swinging and shit like that." So I don't know if he got arrested on the scene or if they picked his ass up later, but apparently the witness identified him and shit. I don't know. I think it's crazy because I thought that beef was fake, you know. I, it really looked like some WWE type shit. You know, every time at a press conference they went back and forth, it looked like two homies just, you know what I'm saying, doing some crazy shit. But um but I don't know, I guess I guess it's it's really real, so is it is what it is. I don't know. Y'all let me know what y'all think about that down in the comments. I mean, do you do you think this is like for another rematch fight or what? Cuz I think Kobe he going after Dustin Poirier. Ain't he? Ain't that who he called out at the end? I don't know. I paid for shit illegally. <clears throat> and the bitch kept buffering. So I ain't watched the, the post-fight shit. But secondly, Chael Sonnen, UFC veteran, trash-talking legend, fool. Um, he also being charged with battery, but 11 counts of the motherfucking shit, dude. Yeah. So apparently the shit pretty serious. What I've read is uh he was charged with like pushing and uh, striking using some type of violence uh against a woman you know what i'm saying but i also read that there was six motherfucking dudes involved this motherfucker attacked six motherfuckers at the same time i also heard it was something to do with like his wife like somebody said some shit about his wife so that's why i don't know the the police ain't released the whole incident because it's a ongoing investigation whatever the fuck but yeah apparently six motherfuckers was involved and uh and one of the counts of battery is is apparently a felony charge because uh he strangled him he was trying to choke his ass out like with his hands or some shit I don't know, that motherfucker Chael, bro, he crazy as shit. But yeah, that's that's pretty much all I just want to talk about. If, like, y'all know why the incident occurred, like, if he was, like, defending his wife or if he just want, felt like fighting six motherfuckers at the same time, I don't know. I read he punched the dude, he was kicking motherfuckers, he elbowed the dude, bro, and apparently he's strangling fools, bro, so. <laughs> so I don't know, bro, but if... If y'all know, if y'all know, uh, 
what happened uh feel free to comment below but yeah I, that's that's pretty much all i want to talk about shit it's theo ross i'll catch y'all